y'all this is Shelby from Simple Homemaker Meals I wanted to show y'all how I plant my potatoes so I have a ton of tubers that are ready to go on the ground and that's what I'm be working on today I'm gonna take you through the process the first thing that I do is so this is one of my tubers I cut the eyes or sprouts um, I think some people even call them tubers sprouts or seeds or eyes so if I refer to them in different ways or something different you've heard, this is what I'm talking about. These are your tubers or your eyes, sprouts, whatever. And I'm actually going to cut them out. And I have a variety of potatoes. These are purple, really, really tasty potatoes. But I'm gonna cut the eyes out because each of these will be one plant. Yeah, baby. So that's my four-year-old son. Um, he's asking why these are purple. These are just a breed of potatoes. And they're just purple. But you're going to cut them off like so. Um, and see, even the little ones, Mama. they will count for them. Mama. Yep, I was. Oh, wait, we do, we do, do that. We can eat the purple. Yeah. But why not? Who wants them? You want to eat the purple potato? I will. They're good. They even get purple in your hands. But these are really cool potatoes. As far as gardening goes, I do everything with my kids in tow. Um, it's a family affair. I think that it is important for your kids to learn, even if it's harder to do it with them. And these will go to my chickens, and they'll eat it. That's my baby crying now. Mm -hmm. But I have a big box of potato tubers. I will show you these. These are my older ones. These have been in a box for about six months. And they are ready to be planted. Um, these actually I can just plop in the ground. But I'm going to just cut them off a little bit. That's pretty amazing. The potato is still intact. Mama, that a normal time. And that's purple time. A big yeah. one. A purple, mm -hmm. a, a hand with a, a normal. So we have different kinds of potatoes. Oh. But even these little eyes. The only thing um, to remember, you can plant store-bought, but you do have to be careful on them carrying diseases. I actually bought some potato tubers the other day, and they seemed like they could possibly have disease. See, this potato has multiple. So one potato could possibly give you five or ten, maybe, um, more potato plants. So that's why I cut it off. Um, but these right here are from a crop I grew last year. I put um, about 15 potatoes in there uh, so I could have more. But this is going to be a lot of potato crops. Uh, my goal this year is to grow enough potatoes and onions to where we no longer have to buy them from the store. That's my goal. Um, I'm going to try to get it. So if you have a goal, I hope that you really try to be intentional about it and try to get after it. But potatoes are pretty easy to grow. Um, they take anywhere from 70 to 100 days to harvest. Um, and I will show, if you follow me on Instagram, I'll show more in depth, like how the potato plant looks. And I will do a follow up on YouTube on here, um, about, uh, when, you Mama? know, you can dig them up and stuff. Mama. I see her. Mama. It's okay. Mama. Yes, there it is. Is it like a pomegranate that was there? Or a power that was there? Um, I'm not a big gummy fan. Well, no. Last small tell sprout. You, last tell you, do like uh, uh, a pine one or a bear or the or a tall one or bear. Not like a tall one. Was Star bear. Wars ones better. Yeah, because because that's what. What? It has layers, taste, and layers taste. Oh man. So I like those bears. Okay. But if I'm always, nah, they're bad. But I'm going to continue doing this, and then here in a little bit, um, 
later in the video. After right after this, you will see. See, I got clunks of dirt. But this is Mama. How is there dirt right there? Because these became, these came from the earth, from our soil. And I just stuck these in because I knew these would be my how I'd carry on our potatoes. But a lot of potato crops here. Um, Mama. Yeah. So the old here. Oh, okay. You're just gonna cut them off like this, and then I will show you here shortly which how you plant them. So, all right. So there is my box. Um, you saw earlier in the video I cut them up. So I'm gonna take a handful of them, set them out here. And I'm gonna start at the beginning of my trench and lay one there. I kind of put that one since that one laid up like that. And then I'm gonna go about a foot apart. Sorry, I'm holding the camera and doing this, but I'm going a foot apart as you can see. And then I'll continue on down this trench until it's done. Then I'll dig another trench and continue. And of course, after I put these in, I'll cover it back up with dirt and mark where I planted it, and that will be that. And well, I'll come back later this year, or later in the year, when it's harvest time, and I'll show you how you dig them up and what to look for as far as your potato plant. But I hope this kind of gives you a little information on how to plant your potatoes. So dig a four to six foot trench, or four to six foot long trench, sorry, and three to five inches deep, and then put them about a foot apart. That's your spacing and cover it back up with dirt and that's that so yeah and follow me on my instagram i'll show some more updates um, as far as what to look for on your potato plants um how big they should get and so forth so i hope y'all have a great day Bye bye